from an incurable madness. The official news version received support from English newspapers such as Times of India and Bombay Gazette. However, the newspaper X said that there was a public questioning of the diagnosis, treatment and mental state of Chhatrapati, which became very controversial. X is actually the name of the person. You can just tell me the you can just tell me what is X or the name of the person who started a newspaper X. Okay, moving moving on to the next next clue for 20 points. It is the logo of the newspaper. Going for 10 points here. Let's see. He is the propounder of the Arctic Home Theory, which stated that Aryans came from Arctic region. Now the audience. I see. Yes, I was coming there. Bala Ganga Tilak is the answer. Prize for that man. It is Bala Ganga Tilak. Yes, this is the last round of the mega finals for the final edition of Agnipath 2013, the Battle of Agnipath. It's a rapid fire round. Questions will appear on the screen. The fastest finger can get points for this. Kill the bill. First question. Here comes the first question. Dash is the second largest city and the last royal capital of Burma, located 445 miles north of Yangon on the east bank of Irrawaddy River. It was regarded by the Burmese as a primary symbol of sovereignty and identity, connected with the freedom struggle of India. Team F, what is the answer? It's Mandalay. Brilliant! Plus 20! The answer is... The answer is Mandalay. Brilliant one. 20 points for Team F. Moving on to the next question. Hands on your buzzer. Had the, he had the first name Gopala. His father was a film producer who worked on the banners of production company Venus Pictures. He obtained an MBA from Jamnala Bajaj Institute of Management Studies, after which he worked as a management consultant. He had two brothers, G. Venkateshwaran and G. Srinivasan. Both of them were film producers. Gentlemen, what is the answer? Speak out. Yes? Brilliant! 10 po 20 points for Team B. It is Mani Ratnam. Good going. Hands on your buzzer. Next one. It was actually made in 1906 in Ghaziabad in British India. They got for the buzzer. Its original formulation include herbs, porcelain, chicory, wine grape raisins, European white lily, blue star lily, fruits like orange, citron. All these things are used to make this thing that originated in 1906 in Ghaziabad. And the answer is, gentlemen, yes. Yes. Minus 20 for them. Minus 20. Brilliant. 20 points for Team F. It is Ruwaza. It's the fine battle is getting very tight. Next question, please. John Lockwood and Alice had met in 1863 and courted at Lake in Staffordshire, England. They married and moved to India in 1865. They had been so moved by the beauty of the lake area that when their first child was born, they included a reference to the lake in naming him. He was named after the lake. He were older editions of his book have a swastika printer on it. Lot of clues. Which man? was named after a lake. 20 points for Team D. It is Rudyard Kipling. Hands on the buzzer. Here comes. He is an Indian former sprinter. He is the first Indian to win a gold medal in the Asian Games, which he won in the first Asian Games held in New Delhi in 100 and 200 meters category. He also competed in the 1952 Summer Olympics. The answer is, next slide. Next slide. It is Levi Pinto. Next one. Keep calm. Take a breath. Dash is a Gujarati and literally means I have cut. Team D, please Sky don't show the answer. You give me. It's a Gujarati and literally means I have cut. The phrase is commonly used by flying kites as a victory shout implying that he's cut the other kites string and is the winner. Gentlemen, Kai Poche is brilliant enough to get 20 points. It is Kai Poche. With that quest question, we officially come to the fag end of the first edition of Agnipa Challenge 2013. The mega finals called the Battle of Agnipa. Team D with 90 points coming at the third position. Put your hands together for Team B with 130 points. And the second position, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Team A. With 170 points, the champion of Battle of Agnipath, Agnipath 2013. Round of applause for Team F.
with 220 points. The winners of Battle of Agnipat. Hope you had a great time watching and listening to Agnipat Challenge 2013. The race is over and the winners of Agnipat Challenge 2013 are eagerly waiting with sparkle in their eyes. Let's move on to the prize distribution ceremony. May I request Dr. G. Madhavan Nair, Ramesh Singh sir, and Jijo Matthew sir, Director Edison Civil Service Academy, to kindly be on the dais. At this juncture, we are indeed honored by the august presence of two great men. It's my pride and privilege to welcome Padma Vibhushan, Dr. G. Madhavan Nair, the former chairman of Indian Space Research Organization. Someone with impeccable records who has exemplified the dictum, don't tell me, sky's the limit when there are footsteps on the moon. His life is indeed a journey of illustrious milestones, which reveals to us the fact that the strength of the effort is the measure of the results. It was he who initiated numerous steps towards the development of futuristic technologies and had given major thrust for the development of telemedicine and teleeducation. How can we Indians ever forget the pivotal role he played in our moon mission, Chandrayaan? In addition to numerous accolades, the nation honored him with Padma Bhushan in 1998 and Padma Vibhushan in 2009. Currently, he's the president of International Academy of Astronautics and the only Indian and the first non-American to hold this post. Sir, we are indeed graced by your august presence. We also have with us a well-acclaimed author of the received textbook Indian Economy by Tata McGraw-Hill. As, the, as this year's civil service examination is highly uncertain as a weather forecast, it's indeed a blessing for all the students here to have with us Ramesh Singh. He has taught in different segments of general studies and optionals like geography, public administration and sociology since 1995. A visiting fellow in management institutions like IMT Ghaziabad and Newport University, California. He has published his articles in critically acclaimed journals such as the mainstream and popular news magazines and dailies including the Hindu, Frontline and various popular civil service magazines. And Director of Edison Civil Service Academy, Jijo Matthews sir needs no introduction. Our very own Jijo Matthews sir who is the wind beneath the wings of Edison and Brahman Ekaden. So as I said, let's move on to the prize distribution ceremony. May I request Madhavan Nair sir and Ramesh Singh sir to kindly do the honors for the first, second and third prize winners. The first prize. I hope the winners are all ready. The first prize of Aknipat Challenge 2013 goes to Saptarshi Purohit and Srijit PS. Saptarshi Purohit and Srijit PS. A big round of applause for them please. Babu and Surya Narayanan. Anton Babu and Surya Narayanan. And the third prize winners, Alan Jude Tampi and Aravind Ragunathan. Alan Jude Tampi and Aravind Ragunathan.